Hello, Namaste and welcome to an all new episode of Hashtag with Abhyang Season 2. Featuring on today's episode is someone who's making a splashing debut. A television superstar who defines the word handsome. Serials like Saraswati Chandra Mahakum just prove that he is definitely one of the biggest stars television has ever seen. Let's get set to welcome a dear friend and the very handsome Gautam Rode. Welcome to the show Gautam. Welcome thank you, to thank you, thank you. Young. Such a pleasure. Finally, Finally we are it's been together. Uh, what 2000 after 2005? Yes. And we were discussing that only. We were discussing that only after 2005. We are meeting up. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, though we 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 met a, a couple of times in between, but it's yeah. been like yeah. In terms of meeting up, meeting up means in terms of properly sitting together, hanging and, out. Yeah, absolutely. Chatting. Oh, things are things, man. You're looking good. Thank you so much. So are you? Ah, thank you. Shining bright star of television uh, industry. Bright star. Bright shining star of the of the television industry. Tell right, going on. Wonderful. So I'm straight going to get you to hashtag with Abhyang. Okay. Have you seen any of the episodes of? Any yes, season? I have. The first season, yes. Wonderful. Really nice. Yeah. So you know we have this little tradition that we follow where okay. uh, just to see that you don't lie. Okay. Uh, we take a oath, which is called as hashtag ki kasam. Oath kiriya. So Kya we, need, those we need a mobile phone. You have to place your hand. Okay. And you have to say this ki main hashtag ki kasam khake kehta hu. Main hashtag ki kasam khake kehta hu. Ki main jo bhi kahunga. Main jo bhi kahunga. Sach kahunga. Sach kahunga aur sach ke sabab kuch nahi kahunga. I like that. Absolutely. Bahut suniye ye line mein. <laughs> now we hope you don't lie because you know okay. mobile phones are the most important thing in today's date and time. Yeah, I am okay to give it away. You just swore on that. Okay, okay, but I'll. I'll so you're not going to lie now. Wonderful. Mm. So we have three sections in the show which mm. are called wicked, bold, and sexy. Wicked, You've... bold, and sexy. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> Do you think you're wicked or bold or sexy? I can be wicked, bold. I don't know. Sexy, I'm not. So I don't know. Okay. okay. A lot of your fans are going to be, you know, disheartened. When yeah, you they say know. That you're not I sexy say this all the time, man. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wicked you are. I mean, I have known you for quite yeah, some time. Yeah. So wicked, yeah. I can. Be. I, I also know you, you're bold, but you're probably a little correct when you talk. You're probably bold in your head. Yeah, I, I think before I speak. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, I've always noticed that. Yeah. Great. So let's just go to the questions yeah. directly. So um, the first section is called Wicked. Okay. And your first question is. How does it feel being one of the most sought after television actors of our time? How do I feel? I, I, you feel nice, it's just that uh, I try to be different in terms of pick up different roles as much as possible. Uh, like I still remember the phase of Saras and Mahakum and Surya Putrakaran and Nach Baliyes, which were completely different than one another. So, but see, the only issue is you don't get those many opportunities every time in life. Absolutely. So I was very lucky, I can say, and uh, I'm, uh, you played lucky man. also. I played lucky also, man. <laughs> so yeah, I played lucky. <laughs> That's why you were <laughs> like that, lucky. Yes. So uh, I've done different kind of shows, different kind of genres, uh, been there, uh, seen all the phases of television as much as possible, good ones, bad ones, average ones. So uh, seen it all. Uh, but yeah, as in very proud to be a part of this industry. Uh, it's because of television what I am today. Whatever little name that I've gathered for my, garnered for myself, it's because of television. And uh, if you say that, uh, the bright shining star, I, I like that sound. We are of very that proud statement. of you. Thank you. We thank are very, very proud. I've been a friend, you know, so I'm very, very proud of you. I mean, every time I see you doing some big show, I'm like, ah, oh, that's my man. Thank you. That's the boy. It's thank like you. that. Really nice, genuine and nice answer. Good one. Let's take you to the second one. Yeah. How did life change after Saraswati Chandra? Because it was Sanjay mm. Lavansali. Mm. I was still seeing a video. I, I reposted one video of one of my admirers uh, on Twitter. As in, I was just seeing a video of mine when I was in UK. See, when I realized that it become a, it became a huge hit was when I was in UK, Leicester. I, I came out of a community hall, I still remember, it's very clear. It was a street full of people. Everyone chanting my name as well as Saras name. Oh, they were oh, holding wow. the placards and that happened in UK. Wow. So it was like I, the person who was walking next to me was saying, I'm feeling like Shah Rukh Khan man. <laughs> <laughs> so it was the first time I actually realized what it is to get that particular character in terms of to get a hit yeah. under your belt. Stardom. I don't know about stardom, but you you can say as in in terms of the first time I realized so many people chanting my name, Gautam Saras, Gautam Saras, and it's still there on Twitter. So I reposted that. Wow. You can see that. So 
as in it, it was must be around uh, 400 500 people on one particular street and uh, everyone as in someone is pulling my jacket someone is pulling uh, my hair and it's it was a, a different feeling altogether man it's it's been really good yeah it's surreal see, yeah you can say that i think i think it was the most perfect casting the way it was shot the way it was you know scaled the way it was put up the way it was written yeah I think the first three beautiful. months of the show were excellent on other level, man. I really loved it, to be very honest. Great in your show because you know working with you know uh, Bansali sir must have been quite something. Yeah, it was, it was. And the guy who, as in who directed it and who really handled it was Mr. Arvind Babul. Uh mm huh. -hmm. So who produced and directed Mahakum? Acha, acha. So okay. he was the director of Saraswati Channel. Okay. Uh, and. Uh, he is something as in he is really really good absolutely so uh, love working with him great yeah. wonderful really nice answer something that you know i'm sure a lot of your fans must be looking forward to listening to from you because that's still something that people uh, remember you with it's a role that's definitely uh, definitely gone down in history next one i think you already answered that but i'm still asking you one director you can keep working with forever Arvind ji again <laughs> I like, thought so we worked together a lot we did a Z show I see. the first one that was in 2008 9 and see. then we did a film for star it was called uh, teri meri love story uh, that was the first film of that slot mm -hmm. uh, rajin shahi producer rajin shahi produced it okay. arvind ji directed it and i acted in it then we did saraswati chandra then we did mahakum wow. and now we are working on something again wow we're trying to work on something again What? so love to work with him as in great guy he is the best on television fantastic uh, so no doubt about that great so yes my next section is called bold so okay. the questions are going to be bold. little bold Ooh. answers are supposed to be little bold Ooh. no diplomatic answers one thing about the indian television industry you would want to change that we don't follow the rut in terms of if on one channel if one genre or one particular show becomes a hit every channel every production house wants to, wants to make the same thing see i don't blame them at the same time because that's what the audience wants to see that's what we think we think and yeah. we want to play safe yeah so sometimes i just want everyone to take a bold step <laughs> and try to be more brave and try to experiment a little rather than just following one particular channel on one particular show that that's become a hit yeah so i think that should be a change so if you ever become a producer you are going to uh, probably i just hope i get a chance and they listen to me and the channel entertains me to make something different you will why not see it's just that it's see new producers don't have much say in the I market in the beginning i am so, a producer so i am I'm, i'm actually going through that yeah so <laughs> now again it's like uh you you just waiting for someone to believe in you absolutely and back you at the same time absolutely. that you want to do something different and honest and you want someone to kind of just believe in you and give you that chance ki boss okay fine you've come with something different and you believe in it so i believe in it and let's make something good together just go ahead and make it so yes wonderful really nice answer next one one habit of yours that you uh, can't live without and you don't want to do without live without i think my wife will vouch for that my <laughs> wife is there man she is looking at me yeah yeah we can have a close up of hers <laughs> <laughs> so i think i don't know about habit but it's my gym my workout which i can't live without and sometimes people can't deal with it people can't deal with it <laughs> so yeah so that particular habit the uh, workouts but i i love working out i love being fit wonderful really nice but but, but that's not such a uh, such a bad habit that you want to get rid of i don't want to get rid of it but i'm sure you're enjoying it next one the weirdest rumor or the funniest rumor you've ever heard about yourself weirdest that i'm dating three girls at the same time oh my god that was i don't know when ages back and okay. two of them i didn't know only oh my god out of the lot and one of them was an acquaintance not exactly a friend also so that was weird and i i heard that in one particular day only that okay fine i'm dating this one i'm dating this one i'm dating this one and it was out in the media only oh and two god. of them i never interacted never said hello to go, what the hell man was going on well, that's how that's how work. the industry is yeah. absolutely interesting 
नेक्स्ट सेक्शन इज कॉल एज सेक्सी सेक्सी Yeah. Meri pant bhi sexy, meri shirt bhi sexy. That's yeah. sexy. But then you just keep, you know, you just said that you don't think you're sexy. No, no, not at all. But, but this will decide that. Oh. Okay. <laughs> on a scale of one to ten, how much would you rate yourself as an actor and on good looks? Actor maybe six, good looks maybe four. What? Yeah. That's just too much of modesty happening here. I don't know yet. Did, you, did your mobile phone just crack? Just check. <laughs> maybe. Mobile phone. <laughs> Did it just like bip, bip, bip. Okay. Okay, I'll change. Actor maybe seven. Looks maybe four. <laughs> Still the same. Still the same. Okay. We say ten on ten for both. Oh, the bab. Next one. What, according to you, is your sex appeal? Sex. You should ask my wife that. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what's my sex appeal? I am a good person. This is sex appeal. Learn that. They come, but that's why I say I'm not sexy. My wife thinks like that. That's the wife answering. Yeah, I am a good person. Yeah. The wife is being very honest, brutally honest. What is your? What do you think is your sex appeal? A body, maybe. I don't know. Man. Okay. Good one. Okay. Next one. Three things you notice in a beautiful girl. Three things I notice in a beautiful girl. Uh, the way she speaks. The smile, eyes, and so again you. the good person part. Okay. So yes. Okay. Yeah. Four things actually. Four things actually. Nice. And the last one, a little naughty one. I don't know how do you answer that. Your biggest fetish is. Fetish? Sweets, I can say. Really? Yeah, man. What? As in cakes, clothes. Ah, sorry, ah, clothes, clothes, clothes. I was just going to ask you where the where does the sweet go? I mean. I don't know. I, I if I eat, I eat a lot. If I don't, I never touch it. So sweet is uh, sweet. I love. I eat ladoos. I love ladoos. On one of my birthdays, that that's the other thing that I fell sick uh, after eating one kg of cake. Oh my god! Whole cake I ate. Ten minutes I finished it. Man. One kg cake. One kg cake. Man. And you fell ill after that. Yeah. Upset stomach. <laughs> yeah. Everything happened to me, man. Everything wrong happened to me. I was sick on my own birthday, man. After that. Awesome, man. You've done really well. We're done with the three sections. Wicked boy, sexy was really quick. Hmm. Now the most difficult, you know, one okay, that you have okay. to still answer. Oh. You have to say some good things about me. Oh. That's the most award-winning reaction oh, that I was waiting for. <laughs> <laughs> I keep doing that. Huh? All awards for that reaction. <laughs> See, it, we've met a couple of times. Yes. We've spoken a lot. We've interacted a lot on messages. Uh, messages, but one, phones. But one really good thing about you is uh, you've been a friend throughout. As in, you've never lost touch. I've not been that nice. I'm, be, I'm admitting that in front of the camera. That, uh, but you've been always there. You kept asking me how am I doing, how are things going. So that's one great quality about you. So that's why still after I don't know 16 years. 17 years, we are still in touch. It's all because of you. So the whole credit of this friendship goes to you. How sweet! So wow. I am being brutally honest about that, because uh, see, uh, very few people take out time for other people. Yeah. So we, because we all are busy in our own lives, yeah. as in, and yeah. you move around, yes. you do your own thing. Then after that, you, as very few people stay in touch, and you stay in touch, man. So Wonderful. Great thing about that. And how does it feel on being on hashtag with Abhram? It feels great, man. Shooting with a friend. So finally, we're doing something we together. Finally, we are doing something After together. After so many years of, yeah. Yeah. you know, saying that let's let's do something together. Thank you so much, Gautam. Thanks a ton for being on the show. What a pleasure to have you. Same, man. And I hope you also enjoyed uh, being Loved on the it. show. Loved. If there's anything you'd like to say to your audience, to your camera. Hey guys, if you like this episode, kindly like and subscribe our Facebook page and YouTube channel. If you like this episode, kindly like and subscribe our Facebook page and YouTube channel. Hey guys, if you like this episode, kindly like and subscribe our Facebook page and YouTube channel. <laughs> Lovely.